hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and on today's video i'm going to be showing you how i got this hairstyle that i have on here which is like a crisscross uh, rubber band hairstyle so if you want to see how i achieve this hairstyle then keep on watching so i'm starting by parting my hair i'm just sectioning the front this is where i'm going to do the crisscross using the rubber bands and i'm sectioning like three parts and out of the three parts i'm going to get like four portions in each and out of these four portions i'm going to crisscross my hair So for my edge control I'm using this molding gel and this is by styling dreads and I'm applying it on the roots just to make everything smooth and clean. And for rubber bands I'm using these little rubber bands that I got from Clicks and these are like the best rubber bands. They come in these cute little bags and they're like my favorite. And I'm moisturizing my rubber bands before applying them with my Jamaican black castor oil. So this will prevent breakage when I remove the rubber bands from my hair. So after applying the rubber band, I'm twisting my hair. And I'm also applying a little bit of that molding gel just to keep my hair smooth and moisturized and also to have like a clean twist. So I'm twisting the first two in the front. So once I'm done with that, I am going to crisscross, which means one from the top left is going to cross over to the one in the back right, and one in the top right is going to cross over to one in the back left. And I'm going to continue doing this in all the sections. Suffocating, I'm waiting and always hesitating. Kryptonite desires set my heart afire. Heart on fire, set my heart afire.
and now I'm done with the front I'm applying the same molding works at the back and I'm applying this into like sections because I want it to be smooth and I don't want to apply too much product so I'm applying as little as possible but I still want it to look sleek and once I'm done applying I'm smoothing with a brush and I'm also applying a rubber band to secure my hair and once my hair is secured I'm taking the twist and I'm attaching them to the bun using rubber bands And now that I'm done with my makeup, I'm taking my drawstring puff and I got this from my local beauty supply store. I love that it has a little comb. So I like to attach the comb and then pull the strings. It's actually like a drawstring and then pull the strings and then I don't really tie them. I just wrap them around and secure them under the puff. And then once I'm done with that, I'm taking my toothbrush with a little bit of the molding gel works and I'm just laying down my edges. And that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.